Beautiful. Here we are down at uh, Hope Island. Um, just, uh, right here. Absolutely. Yep. What do we got, Golf Skate Caddy? Mate, we do. Here it is. Look at. Uh, me? Yeah, 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 a little bit. You can be able to see Christmas. some photos and stuff. Every Thank time. you. Golf skate caddy. Um, yep. The Tura, which yep. is uh, version four, yep. effectively, of their golf skate caddy range. Yep. I've heard about it. I've seen them uh, yeah, in, yeah, the, in the past, yeah, certainly. Film, film clips sort of kick up every now and then. Um, we've, we've had the pleasure of taking it out today and play actually 18 holes on it. Hence why so we're talking not, about it now and so, not before. Yeah, so not just jump on it, zoom around here, and that was it. So I actually got what it was like on the course to play actually 18 holes. Yes. It's always a lot different. And, you know, it's a lot like golf gear, isn't it? The test of it is over 18 holes. Correct. Or Correct. nine holes or some form of golf. But mm -hmm. um, More than just zipping around, which, which is also fun, which I might do in just a second. What do you want, mate? Carrying on. So we've been out, oh, you're right. We've been out, we've played 18 holes, it was brilliant, Hope Island. Um, as you can see, very easy to fold up is one thing. Hey Richard. Yes. Very so, easy to fold up. We'll see a little footage. Yeah, of, uh, as, so, so how do you do it? What, what do you do? Explain it as you're doing it on the video in about 40 seconds. <laughs> in 40 seconds. Beautiful. All right, well have me a drink. Because so, the battery weighs it a little bit, yep. probably a good idea to take the battery out. So. The key does nothing more than just hold the battery in. Bang. Bang, battery out. Right. L literally. The little, button, the little button here, I won't do it because my bag's correct. here. But, folds up the bag. That, that folds down to there. And and, and you're not seeing it on there, but you're seeing it in the, in the so close up two, two little buttons, right, pull that all the way down. Flip it up. Right, and then that will lie folds down. Folds down. Won't lie down. The bag's all there. It, um, weighs that's a bit. It. Weighs fold about it down. 36 kilos. Yep. Easiest way is most of the weight's towards the back, right? So we just put front wheels in the car, bang, lift up the back, whack it in, reverse on the way out. Correct. Pull out the heavy part of it, right, bang, and then it's just reverse. Arm, arm up. Arm up. Lock it in. Uh, lock that part in so that the arm that holds the bag comes back up. Battery all. Oh. <laughs> battery, right? Same it's thing. a solid battery. So you can see which side it goes. Very simple. In there. Whack it in. Done. Bob Girani. Yep. So the key here is really nothing more than just to release the battery for Just you. a locking me mechanism but, um, for the battery. That's it. I mean, you could, you know, you're a big strong bloke like Al, you could leave the battery in and just lift it up if you wish to. But, you know, I just took it out. It does take a little bit of weight because, what, well, good a few kilos well, th there. Yeah, well, that's probably three or four kilos. Yeah. Again, then you've got um, the 30 odd, 35 yep. kilos for the whole thing. So. Yep. It's not light. No, it's certainly no. not light. C certainly, someone that's got uh, like a little ute or a, um, I got I got a van, got a station wagon, perfect for it, isn't it? Yeah. Did you say cross station wagon? A station it wagon. Slides around. It's very good. It's very yep. easy to ride. Really, like like a, like a kid with a new toy. Yeah. Um, it really is. Yeah, you know, very good, very stable. I look. We went up and we went up some hills, down some hills, went on a few little like you know banks. Um, look, very much like a buggy. If you feel that that bank's getting too too much incline into it, then you take the buggy off it. This is, this is very much the same. You know, it's it's set to a speed. You cannot just get on it and go 180 miles an hour. I think it's about um, 17 or 18 k's. Yeah, yeah. We we had it full strap on a couple of things. I think 18 k's is yep. what it's set to. Um, as soon as you take your finger off the accelerator, it pretty well slows down and stops. Yeah, within about you know. two odd seconds. If you yeah. boom, it goes yeah. and to a relatively abrupt stop. Yeah, yeah. So certainly you can build something to slow down, then it goes brrr, and just stops. Um, you know, it's got a reverse on it, so you can reverse it out. If it you does, but you've got to be a complete stop. You would have just yep. heard, I don't know if it'll make it now. No, because I'm not going very far. But yeah, it'll be at a complete stop. It'll nice. beep, and then you, there you go. There's the beep. Yep. And then you can put it in reverse and go. Put it in reverse, and it's D R. D R. D for driver. R for. D for driver. R for Richo. Yep. Yep. It's got a handbrake on the other side. Um, 
The battery's pretty, pretty solid. So we've, well, yeah. right now it says three, um, you know, three, three meters. Uh, we've done about 10 kilometers overall. The battery's yep. about half. Yeah. Yep. So 27, they You're say they can easily get 27 yep. holes out of it. 36 um, might be a push. Yeah. But, um, but 27's a, you could definitely do. So, you know, I might interlace a bit of stuff from, from us doing some videos or, or being out in the golf course as well. But it, it's a very, very solid unit. Uh, it is all one piece, one base, it all folds, and it's all one. Yeah. Yep. Unity. Do you know, what I'm saying, everyone should go and get one of these. There'll be plenty of people that like to carry a bag. Of course. And walk. There's plenty of people that love their buggies. And there's motorised buggies and all sorts of stuff. Depends on what you want. Yes. I do realise that if you own a really tiny little two-door sports car, of course. you will probably struggle to get this in. Well, there's a couple in the car park out there, unless, mate. You, <laughs> unless you get a roof rack. Yeah. Right? But, yeah. You know, for someone that's got, say, a lower set ute, so not necessarily a four-wheel drive ute. No. Um, you know, it's a little station wagon. Yep. Right? Basically anything that's a wagon type. Yeah. Uh, or sort of SUV even, even type. Even a little SUV, you know. You, you could probably fit it as in. As long as you're happy to sort of probably fold the seats down. Yes. Right? But um, I suppose the difference between this and a cart, like cart you can obviously have two people in it, but at least if you've got a car that you can pick this up and throw it in, you, know, you don't have to worry about hauling around a trailer. Um, storage at home, I mean, you can yeah. whack this anywhere. Anywhere in the shed, whatever. As where, you know, you're going to go home and say, where am I going to put my golf cart and missile so we can keep it out in the yard? And yeah. Of course, it'll be stuffed after 12 months sitting out in the yard. I think what you were saying, and I think what we were both saying on the course, is it's very really good for those who just who play golf by themselves to mm. start. Well, not so much by themselves, but are happy just to be by themselves. Um, and that probably live on or very, very close to a golf course. Yeah. Just bang. I mean, they're just literally, there you go. There's your there's house over there, lot, mate. It's locked through. There's a lot through. of houses here. You, know, huh. you, you imagine being a man, but late afternoon like this, you just go, yep, cool, I'm going to duck out. I'm going to whiz around, play three or four holes, and come back home. But look, I can see a lot of bangs. Certainly if you don't play the same course all the time. Um, yeah. It goes up and down the hills pretty easy. Like, you know, it's not like you're going up the hills and it's really struggling. Very stable. Didn't feel like you're going to get thrown off it. Um, no, it, 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 it takes a half a second. It takes a half a second to get used to, and that's literally it. Yeah, yeah. Just I understand it's not going to spit you off. But, but by the time we got down the first bit yeah. away, we were right. Correct. Yeah. And that was pretty well what we were told. That yes. You know what? It'll only take you half a second, and you'll go, oh, this is okay. Look, do you know what I was saying? With the kids, I have no doubt my kids will go, I'll come to golf with you. Yeah. Put your bag on it, I'll ride it, and you can just walk around. That's not such a bad idea either. No, it's not. Do you know what? No. At least the kids are outside, um, getting a bit of fresh air. But I, I think there is. I think certainly if you have limited space at home to store some stuff, if you couldn't be bothered, th th this took literally, what, a minute to get out of the car and a minute oh, to get back may in. Maybe even right? less. Do you know what I mean? If, if I was to plunk that, that, not even bother with that battery yep. now, fold, fold that bad girl down, yep. then that. Like seriously, that thing is now ready to be put in the car, and that was what, five, seven seconds, something yep. like that? I reckon. So no, it's, it doesn't know, take long. By the time, it, even allowing to put your bag on and everything, all, because it's just got a strap the same as what a buggy's got. Correct. Um, even if you allow yourself five minutes, it's got to be easier then. Well, this way, it's just as easy as a normal buggy. It's well, just heavier. The, the, the problem is when you, buy, zoom, zoom. when you buy a buggy is that, you know, you need a trailer. So when you go to a golf course, you need two parking spaces. So you can park and, and get your buggy off and... Oh, look, Battery's I, about to die, Richo. We, 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 we better, we better finish up before it dies. I, look, I think... It, Literally, 20 seconds. I think fantastic. I would certainly go, yep. You know, I liked standing up. It was really good. I felt that I didn't get as stiff as what I normally would, sitting and getting up, sitting and getting up. So I thought it was fantastic. Um, I really like it. Love it. It's fantastic. Yep. Thanks, Grant. Thanks, Golfscape. Beautiful. And don't forget, smash that like button. <laughs> 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 you that's what you say, don't you? Oh, that's what they say to say. Hey, I don't know. If you don't like it, don't like it. Hit, hit this like. Who cares? Yep. I don't care. But anyhow, see you then. Beautiful. See you. <laughs>